Welcome to Plain de Champagne. My name is Haley. Today we are going to talk about dining in France and the 10 things that you absolutely should not do. But before we get started, consider hitting that subscribe button if you want some more videos like this. And you can always find more information on my website at plaindechampagne.com. Let's get started. First, do not be afraid to wave down the waiter when you're walking in that restaurant. In the United States, we're very used to having a hostess stand there, inquire about the size of our party, they lead us to a table. That's not how it works in France. Really insert yourself, put your hand up, say, excusez-moi, monsieur, madame, etc., etc. Usually they'll gesture you to a few different tables. You can pick the one that works the best for you. Number two, don't be annoyed that the tables are close together. French restaurants are a very intimate setting and they like to squeeze as many possible tables as they can into that small space. So don't be surprised if you might have to move your chair a little bit or move your table over a little bit to help people get in. Number three, avoid the place advertising that English menu. And especially avoid the place if there are pictures on the menu. Run as far as you can and never go back. In Paris especially, usually all of the restaurants will have a dual menu, English and French. But what I'm saying is don't go to the place that is advertising in big letters. We have baguette or whatever. Find those intimate places that are a little more tucked away. That's where you're gonna find those really amazing French dishes. Number four, don't get conned into buying water. Just like in the United States, they are obligated to give you free water if you ask for it. But if the waiter says still or sparkling and you just say still, they can bring you over a bottle of water that you're gonna have to pay for. So what you can say is a carafe of water and that's just their tap water. And one more thing about the water, the waiter won't refill that carafe if you finish it without asking. A great rule of thumb in French restaurants, ask and you shall receive. Which brings me to number five. Don't expect the waiter to check in on you. In the United States, you're gonna learn the waiter's name and they're gonna make sure your food came out okay. That's not how it works in France. They are just there in the background and they will leave you undisturbed unless you wave them down for something. Number six. Don't avoid the cheap wine. Because you're in some of the best wine regions in the world, the wine is just cheap because you're getting it from that region. If you're in Lyon, drink a Côte de Rhone. If you're in Bordeaux, drink a Bordeaux. Basically just do some research about the wine of your area. That will be the cheapest and it's delicious. Another thing, in the United States, wine usually just comes by glass or by bottle. In France, oftentimes they'll have different sizes. So you can do a glass, a pichet, po, filet, it kind of depends what region you're in, but it's like a little pitcher or a bottle. Number seven, don't ask for a to-go box. In France, you're just expected to finish your meal and you don't take it with you. It's just the way it is. Also, if you don't finish your meal, it might be a little bit rude to the chef. So bring your stretchy pants, finish that meal. Number eight, don't feel like you're in a rush in French restaurants. When you sit down at a French restaurant, that is your table for the rest of the night. And if you sit there waiting for the waiter to drop your check by, you will wait all night. Seriously, that's not bad service, that's France. In the United States, they'd be clearing that table around you, like get out, I need to fill this table again so I can get more tips. Whereas in France, the waiters make a salary and tips are just extra. Which brings me to number nine. Don't tip a full 20%. They already make a salary. But just because they make a salary doesn't mean it's a big salary. So if you have the means, definitely treat your waiter or waitress accordingly. I suggest anywhere from five to 10% for a full sit down dinner. More on that 10% if they really were accommodating to you. But if you're sitting down for lunch at a cafe and you got a croque madame and you maybe saw the waiter once, just leave a couple euros. That is totally fine. You do not need to tip that full 20%. And number 10. Don't expect to do that checkbook dance where if you're paying with a card, you put the card in the checkbook and then they take it away and then you sign your name with a tip. That's not how it works. If you wanna pay with a card, put a card on the checkbook and they will bring the credit card machine over to you. If you wanna give them a tip on the card, make sure you tell them before they put the card in the machine. They have to add it before. It's not where it's on a receipt and you sign it after. So there you have it, 10 things you should not do in a French restaurant. If you've been to France before and you've experienced this, please let me know on my latest Instagram at Plain de Champagne. And if you found this video interesting, helpful, et cetera, et cetera, make sure you subscribe below. And as always, you can find more information on my website at plaindechampagne.com. Thanks for watching. Cheers.